What up, though? What's going on? Happy Monday, y'all. My face look light right there. What's going on with it? I don't know why it look light right there. Y'all see that spot? No, oh, that's weird. I feel like I ain't no damn hair right there. Yeah, that's weird. I don't know. But what's up, y'all? What's going on? I am cold. I'm about to give me some white sauce. I want some cheese, eggs, and some hash browns. That's what I'm about to get. And then I'm about to, uh... Let's see. This is what I'm gonna get. Ooh, I'm about to come back in the house. I'm getting my cable switched out to AT&T today. I need to film. I'm recording something. Hold on. I need to film and I need to, uh, what else? Yeah, that's it. I need to film for sure. I'm filming two videos. I think I'm gonna film like a little tutorial for Instagram. And then I need to film this hair, this hair, uh, how I prep my hair before I get it installed. I'm gonna film that video too. So yeah, that's what I'm on. It's cold, bitch. Why is it so cold outside? And I thought I was doing something by getting my AirPods. They not even charged. I need to start charging them at night, like with the rest of my stuff. As soon as I put them in my ear, they uh, let's cut off. So, I'm at Waffle House. I got some hash browns and some cheese eggs. Okay, so I'm, I'm gonna I want some meat. I want bacon. I was gonna get something, but I was like, nope. I only got a few more days. 26. It's a 26. Five more days. That ain't bad. I can eat bacon on the first. Well, I'm going to start incorporating bacon and chicken back into my diet because I don't want to give it up completely and I don't want my stomach to hurt when I eat it. So, I'm going to eat it sometime. Just sometime. Not every day. Alright, y'all. So, I just got done washing my hair. Um, I don't know if I'm going to use the footage I had, but happy Monday. What's up? What up, doll loves? What up, doll bro? Drop it to the floor. My name Lex Low. Make that thing pop. You know I'm not a thot. You know I'm not a cop. And you know I can't pop. Say so your girl can't pop. But I twerk. I make that thing work. I make that thing twerk. What's going on? So, I'm about to take all this stuff off my bed. Well, I got a whole bunch of shit on my bed because I'm about to, uh, I don't got a whole bunch of stuff, but I'm about to, uh, wash my sheets. I'm going to wash my comforter, too. AT&T is about to come and change my cable over to, I'm getting my cable switched over to AT&T. So that's what I'm doing. I'm about to blow dry my hair though. I think this is my last time putting my hair up in the bundle. If I'm a video on how to, on how to wash these bundles, I'm taking them to the queue tomorrow. She's gonna make me a wig and I'm gonna be wearing that wig because, yeah, no ma'am. No ma'am, I just want my hair braided. I wanna get some oil from this girl. So, so I can just grow my hair out. My hair just needs a break and this middle part is short. But let me get ready for this damn AT&T man. I'll talk to y'all in a minute. So AT&T came and put my uh my um internet in and the box keep on fucking saying it's disconnected, it's not connected. He talking about, oh I gotta come back on Monday. I'm gonna come back on Monday and we can Sir, I don't have no come back on Monday because I gotta upload vlogs, I gotta watch Hulu. I what are you talking about come back on Monday? I don't care nothing about the TV, I'm gonna my Wi Fi. But I will be asking his ass as soon as he calls. He told me he's calling tonight. When you call tonight, I will be having four questions. When you come in with this box, that's the first question. And you need to be coming at 8 o'clock, 8 a.m. on Monday morning. Secondly, do my Wi-Fi work. I ain't even checked to see. I got to check to see when I get back home, but I'm starving. So I need to eat. I tried to have a productive day today, but I didn't really want to record while he, he was in here. I recorded like an intro and outro for my hair tutorial, but y'all still need to record me like washing the bundles and stuff. But yeah. I think I'm going to try to hook up my old Wi-Fi. If that Wi-Fi don't work, I'm going to try to hook it up and then on Monday I'll cancel the old. Somebody told me to go check my P.O. box. So that's what we're going to go do too. I gotta go get, I gotta go get some tissue and paper towel and then I need to, um, I'm hungry. I don't know what I want to eat though. I don't want nothing really. I want chicken. That's what I want. Some chicken. I want to 
want a steak bowl. I'm about to stop at home and go get my coat. Because it's cold outside. And I don't know why I'm outside with this, just this on. Like it ain't 44 degrees. Ooh. I hope y'all having a good Monday so far. Put a smile on that face. Turn that frown upside down. <laughs> ah, I used to work with this lady at Carmex. She used to be like, welcome to work. Girl, shut up. You don't even want to be at work. We used to be... Me and my friend Gianni used to be so irritated every time she used to say that shit, bro. And she was so, and she was from Detroit. She was a manager. She was so damn lazy. She, welcome to work. Welcome to work. Every time somebody could come in. Welcome to work, girl. You be looking at her ass. But don't nobody ever say it back. It be like probably like two people that say it back. We all just be looking like, girl, don't sit down. Just do too much. And she was one of them people that always, you know how some people at the job that just always got a man. Like, always got a different man talking about to the point where you can't even keep up. Like, who is this man? Yeah, I'm talking to this guy. Da, 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 da. And how you meeting all these folks? Like, they got to be on POF or something on the dating site. They got to be. Because how you meeting all these people? How? Hold on, y'all got to get my coat. I'm right So, Sada Baby got a new CD. One of these songs is my shit, girl. I'm in the car jamming. You know, you you know when you start listening to your jam. Start driving fast, girl. I thought I was gonna get a ticket. I was like, Lord have mercy, please don't let me get no ticket. What is this? The article is too large for your box. What the heck? I got a lot of stuff, y'all. I got two. I know them from Juicy Fruit. Damn, I gotta wait till Monday to get my other thing. I had just got a phone call, y'all. But I got two things. So I know these two lippies are from Juicy Fruit. And then there's something in here. One of my subscribers sent me something. She said, just as a thank you for me being so influential to her. And then. I got something in my mailbox that is the article is too large. I gotta pick it up on Monday when they open up again. So yeah. I wanna know what the hell it is. Y'all know I'd be so anxious. I love giving me a present up in my up in my P.O. box. So yeah, right now, I ain't even gonna hold y'all up. Like I really been thinking in my head. And I'm getting kinda like fed up kinda because it's certain shit I want to launch in my business that I feel like I can't because I don't have the money to do it. And that leads me with two things. Like, I tell y'all, when you feel like you don't have enough money or you don't, even if you don't have enough money to start, you can get another job. So I'm at a place where I'm like, okay, do I need to get another job or like do something like on the weekends? In order to just follow my business and do what I want to do when it comes to my business, because at this time I can't, I, I don't have, the, I don't have the means to be able to. To be honest, I'm doing a lot to you. unless I really like buckle my ass down and not eat out or nothing, and just really buckle down and take that money and then um, use it in my business. But I don't know. I just been really frustrated for the past few days because I'm like, just certain shit I want to do and. You gotta give shit time to, you gotta give it time. I got lashes, I want more lashes, and it's like, I want, I don't know, bro. I really don't see no light at the end of the tunnel, if I could be honest. If I could be really honest, like, I ain't even told nobody this shit, but I don't see no light at the end of the tunnel. I'm just sitting here like, it's stressing me out bad. Like, I want to, there's so much I want to do. so much I want to offer and like and then, then it's like unless it's, you got to figure the fuck out and then nobody owe you nothing to figure it out with you like I got to figure it out I'm gonna let y'all know what I do they have so much Valentine stuff at, at uh, Kroger y'all got a Valentine for Valentine's Day I don't know if I do or if I don't I took my lippy off and my nose is running from eating my tendrum but I'm about to open my present from uh this is from actually sincerely lala so she follows me on instagram and this is the person that told me like she sent me something so Ooh. <clears throat> i got another package but 
that's from lavish events the other package okay let's see i need some scissors or something jesus hold on y'all look what i'm trying to open this with the charger Mm. I'm so anxious. Let's see what it is. I'm using a razor. All right. What is this? Oh, girl! It says Lash Lord. Alexis. This is so fucking gorgeous, bro. Look at the writing. It's gold. This ain't no Dollar Tree shit either. This is nice. You see what I'm saying? This is nice. Classy. Hold on. Alexis. Is this a sticker? This is like a vinyl that says Alexis on there. I think it's a sticker. I'm probably going to put it on my computer. May with love. Thank you for your purchase. Follow us on social media. The Pink Print Studio. So that's her business. Thank you for your purchase, little cards. I want to get some cards made like this for Lash Lord. I don't have none. I handwrite everything that I've seen for Lash Lord. Shop the looks. Look, that is cute. And it got a card that says, You are so awesome. <sighs> What up, though? <laughs> Lex, I hope you enjoy the gifts. Keep grinding and inspiring others. P.S. Don't put the cup in the dishwashers. <laughs> I don't do. I don't use the dishwasher. I don't even know how to use one. Sincerely, Lala. Thank you so much, Lala. Thank you so much. I'm putting my card in my thing. Hold on, I got something. Oh no, I did some paper. Thank you so much. This was so freaking thoughtful. Like. I'm using this. I'm not using this for custom, for clients. Mm -mm. I'm using this. This made me want to cry. This is so sweet. Like, for real. For y'all. Well, y'all y'all know I always do this shit every time. But. For somebody to think about you. Or like. Say that you like impacted their life. It's just crazy to me. And I'm just a regular ass person. Like, I'm not. It's just crazy to me. But thank you so much, girl. I don't want to cry on camera, but thank you so much. Well, I don't want to cry because I got my makeup on. But I really am a like So this is so fucking cute. Like, and it's purple. And, you know, last year colors is I like white, black, gold, and like a hint of purple. And this is just means so much. I'm keeping this. And I'm when I get flued out somewhere in the else, or when I'm going out of town, I'm using this bag. I'm not gonna I normally mess up my bags, but this is gonna be my makeup bag. I don't care. I'm keeping it and I'm so grateful for this. I am so grateful. Thank you. Thank you. And she made this because this is a yeah, she made this bag. She put this on here herself. So fucking sweet. We might need to work together, girl, to come out with some lash lower uh bags. For my company. I gotta message her on Instagram. I'm about to finish watching This Is Us and then I need to film a video. So I'm about to, I'm about to, <clears throat> I'm about to charge this battery. I need to film me washing my bundle. So yeah, I'll talk to y'all in a minute. Or probably tomorrow. Cause tomorrow I'm going to church. I'm getting up early and taking my ass to church at 9.30. And I'm going to do my makeup for church too. Yep. I'm, I gotta do my makeup. And then I'm going to do uh, Alex's makeup at one o'clock. So I need to clean my brushes and stuff. So I will talk to y'all in a minute. It's Sunday, my favorite day. Drop it this way, pop a thing today. What's going on? So, I'm about to go to church. I'm going to the 9:30 service. I normally don't go to the 9:30 service. I normally go to 11:30, but I need to uh, go to the 9:30 service because I'm doing someone's makeup at one o'clock. I'm practicing on Alex at one. So I was like, let me get my ass up this house and go to church. I put me on like a, my little cute little shirt or this little shirt. I ain't wear this since I was in the church with some little pants i was gonna wear my my uh mules but it's cold it's 30 degrees 34 degrees yeah so y'all yeah, know i be using my um 
I use my if you watch my makeup tutorials and my makeup videos, I use mascara on my eyelashes before I put my uh, falsies on because they my lashes stick straight out and sometimes like if I don't put enough mascara to like lift my lash, one will look like one way, like look straight, and the other one will look like it'll be the same lash, but it'll look like it's two different lashes based off of how I place it on my eye. So I found that when I use the mascara, I really like the mascara from the shopping club. Like I literally love it. If I just wear mascara, I think it's just bomb. Like it really uh <clears throat> make your like makes you look like you have lashes even if you don't have none. It's really bomb. But I don't know if it's because of the whatever they use, not chemicals, but whatever they use in it, like to make it. When I attach my lash to it, girl, it'd be so hard to get my lash off. It literally be like pulling my lashes off. Damn near. And I've never experienced that before because any other mascara that I use, it doesn't do that. So I still be using it, I still was using it or whatever. But girl, I had to uh, come to the realization that this right here, this part of my eyelash from the lashes I took off the day before yesterday, girl, it's sparse, okay? It's a little bit, some of the hair is gone. That's what I'm telling you, it's gone. I look like bald hair Sally by the eyelash. And it ain't gonna work out for me. I said, oh no, I gotta take a little break. You gotta put some Jamaican black castor oil or rub it all up in my eye and take and take some hair, skin, and nail vitamins because I can't be having no lashes. But I did this before, so it ain't a big deal. It'll grow back. But I was like, uh-uh. Girl, I think I pulled it out even worse. I said I'd get some more mascara. I don't remember. I think I was using the Better Than Sex mascara. I'm gonna have to get some more of that. Or get something from like what Target or something. One of them little mascaras and use that. Cause girl, don't nobody wanna be bald lash. When you, I already got little lashes, but then when you like pull your lashes out from, from wearing falsies, then you look like googly moogly by the eye. No ma'am, no ma'am. Oh yeah y'all, so I ordered the first Lex Low like merch shirt, but I don't know, I'm trying to think. I like it, it's just basic. It's just really basic. Like it's white with black. But I got the black and like with a black background. I mean, it's cute. But I don't know. I gotta figure out what it is that I wanna do, really. I'm gonna do something cute for y'all. I want y'all to be like, oh, this is so cute, you know? Or I love this or something cute. But y'all know I love simplicity. So I love simple shit. I love simple shirts. I love simple things just in general. I don't really like like all that extra. That just ain't me. I, be, I like it when other people do it, but I be like, I just like simple stuff. I like to put on simple shirts. I like to be simple. That's it. Yeah, I feel like I could have worn my mules. It's cold, but it ain't cold, cold. I feel like I look crazy with these boots on and then these dang on dress pants. But I don't wear baby doll shoes no more. I used to wear baby doll. I used to love a baby doll shoe. Y'all know what a baby doll shoe is? I don't know if y'all call it baby doll shoe. Y'all call it flats. But I used to love one. And I used to always wear them to work, regular life. I don't think I would wear no baby doll shoe now unless I was going to like a nine to five job and I needed a shoe to put on with my little business clothes. Other than that, or I probably still wear loafers or something. I don't know. What y'all wear with y'all business clothes? Heels? Uh -huh. Y'all, it's cold. It was cold in church. I'm like, I am freezing. And I had a sweater on. I'm glad I ain't had like no short sleeve shirt on. My cheeks so cold. Where I part? Oh. Hold on, I gotta tell y'all in a minute. Hold on. Uh, I gotta go home and grab my makeup kit. And also I gotta take this weed to uh, Q. I need some gas. There's a lot going on. So church is basically about, it's our anniversary in my church, so they he just talked about like the growth, like where how to what we gonna be doing for the year. Um, just the growth, just like a state of union for the church, basically. But the main thing I got out of it was y'all know yesterday I just told y'all like I feel like I was at a standstill when it came to my business, just overall. I just feel like uh I don't know. So it's crazy because I uh <coughs> he was preaching and he was talking about first thing he said, he was talking about Bethsheba and um david and how when david you know david had sex with bathsheba bathsheba was married he ended up getting um he ended up getting bathsheba husband killed because he put him on the front line in the army and 
he ended up getting killed. Um, because of that, God caught made his son die. Okay. Um, yeah, God made his son die. I think it is it, David and Bathsheba. Yeah. So God made his son die. And he was so sad and he was fasting and he was like, please don't let my son die fasting for his son not to die. But God had already decided what he was gonna do and he made his son die. Um, they they were scared that his friends were scared to tell him because they like, um, he gonna be sick. If if we do tell him, he gonna be sick. So they ended up he was they was whispering, he ended up finding out, hey, they yeah. So they ended up telling him. He was and he took it surprisingly well and he was just like he got up, he washed his face. He went to praise the Lord, and then he ended up having sex with Bathsheba and having another baby who he named Solomon. Is it Solomon or Samuel? Solomon, I believe. Um, but out of that, my pastor was saying that you have to get up. Although things may have happened to you in the past, although we may have went through whatever, you still have to get up, wash your face, and be prepared. get prepared for the next day and move forward. Although things go wrong, you have to move forward. Although you may mess up, you got to move forward. Although this may not have worked out, you have to move forward. And I got that out of church. That was the first thing. Second thing is, my pastor, was he was still doing like the state of union thing. And then he started talking about, start with what you have. He was like, this ain't even part of what I'm supposed to be saying. But when I tell you I needed to hear that because, like, God has equipped you with what you need. And I was in a place, I, told, I just told y'all this yesterday, like, where I was like, okay, well, what do you have, Alexis? You got this, you got that. He was saying, no, you may not have the camera, but you got a phone. You know what I'm saying? So start with what you have. And he was saying, when they first started the church, he started with what he, they started with what they had. They did some things wrong, they did something incorrectly, but they started, they did with what they had. And you, you have to start with what you have. When I tell you, I just bust out crying, like, because I'm just like, I don't know. I have product, I have certain stuff, I have this. I have the ability to do people's makeup. So I have the ability to get what I want or to do what it is that I want or to have the money that I want to have. It's just that I don't want to start or I feel like I can't do it. And it's just crazy. Like So the two things I got, start with what you have. So wherever you at in life or whatever you got, stop, stop waiting on things to be perfect. Things won't be perfect. That Ain't nothing ever going to be perfect. I'm going to tell you that now. Start with what you have. Save your money if you want something better. And that's just kind of how that goes. Second thing is, don't look back on the past. Focus on what you have now and making the best for yourself right now. And it, even though something goes wrong, don't let it knock you down to the point where you just feel like, I can't do this. Or you just so messed up in the head. Or you just, you, this ain't what I'm, like I was going through a whole trickle down effect. Of, this ain't what I'm supposed to be doing then. And why God, why I feel like God provides for other people. Maybe this is what they supposed to be doing and not me. You see what I'm saying? You can't, you can't do that. You can't, you can't because of some something that happened yesterday or that happened 10 months ago or oh they didn't want this so i i guess i ain't supposed to be doing this or oh i tried this and it ain't doing this you know what i'm saying no so those are two things i got on the church today right? it was really good church, church was really good and we learned about like where the church is going and how my pastor sees the church and all that so it was cool but i'm about to make my way to this bank right quick to put this money in the car i gotta pay my insurance and then i'm going home to uh I'm going home to get my makeup kit, get this weed. I gotta call Q. I'll talk to y'all in a minute. All right, y'all, I'm at Whole Foods right quick. I was gonna turn back around, but my subscriber, Jasmine, who works at Whole Foods, she told me, she texted me on, I mean, she DM'd me. Well, no, she texted me, she got my number. She texted me and she told me that they have a dancing goat coffee here. So that's what I'm about to get, some dancing goat coffee. I was like, damn, they had dancing goat coffee here this whole time, I never even knew. What the heck, bro? Y'all, they didn't even have this and ghost coffee. I had to get, well, they got it, but she said they didn't have it. They wasn't brewing it right then. So I got this Java something, and it's strong and it's nasty. I tried to put as much sugar as I could, but when you put raw sugar, it's not like uh, <clears throat> processed sugar. Processed sugar is like sweet, sweetens it up real quick. Raw sugar it just doesn't work out for me. I don't like it, but I'ma just stick it through. Okay. Just had to run up in the house right quick. I couldn't even get y'all on the thing, cause girl. It'd be a lot trying to figure out. I be getting so anxious, like, okay. I'm, I be wanting to make sure I got everything. And I need to get some lashes. Like, I need to buy, like, 
more lash lower lashes to use on clients. So I'm gonna go to the beauty supply and get these lashes because I do not want to use mommy lashes. I'm just practicing, so I'm just gonna go buy some like. And Alex has long, big eyes, so I think I'm gonna do like um, I'm gonna do like a uh, what a dramatic lash kind of. Or like a nice, like, I may start off short and then get longer, but we don't need nothing that's going to elongate her eyes. Oh, uh, gosh, I want to get, these all look like, I'm like, these ain't even mink. <laughs> I'm bougie now, bro. I should have just bought my lashes, but I can't. Um, I really don't know what to get. Maybe I might do these, but double them. These so thin. Can't be able to see them. I don't be seeing no pictures. Okay. I put on my story. All right. Oh, my booty, look. Alex over here, y'all. Look at Alex. I just got a Alex done dyed her hair. Look, now she's trying to act holy because the camera on. Look. <laughs> Somebody can't be doing all that. I just got out of church. It's Sunday. She got the gospel music playing. I said, okay, then. We're gonna be right here in front of this window because I, I don't like all the window. I feel it in my shotgun. All right, y'all. This is Alex before. Mm, we're using some, some natural light in the day. I'm tired of that kitchen. <laughs> all right, y'all. This is Alex makeup. She looks so cute. Hardest client of the year. <laughs> and she got her lash lord glitter. So icy. So cute. Bros. What up, dog bros? That's it. That's all I got. What up, dog bros? What up, dog bros? My name is Alex. I drop it to the floor. <laughs> Alex, Alex been watching the vlogs 10 years. She don't know what's going on. What's the name? Wow. We got to go this way? Yeah. Wow. You been here having the same? Wow. Girl, I'm always, I always get lost every time I go somewhere. Ooh. I mean, she thinks she cute, but she didn't put a little glitter on a bitch ass. She's so happy. She, she was all like, she got everybody at home thinking she done. She she been doing my, a photo shoot all day. I will be tomorrow. Oh, she doing a photo shoot, girl, for the Jesus is King collection. I don't know the name of it. I'm just playing. I'm just playing. <laughs> <Good job. laughs> I'm coming out with me a blood of Jesus collection. I already. The blood of Jesus collection. Thank you. Yeah, I feel like I did so good on Alex's makeup. I really liked it. Um, I really got to get this. It's a certain moisturizer I need for people that got dry skin. First thing, I need to get that. And then, um, because she does have some dry patches, and my moisturizer just wasn't working out. It worked out, but I feel like it still was catching on to some dry patches, so I could have moisturized better. And another thing is, um, I matched her really good. Like, I had to match... I had to mix three foundations to match her and I matched her really well. It was so easy to do too. Like, you know how, if I haven't told y'all, I tell y'all this on live all the time. The scariest thing about me, for me, about doing people's makeup is matching them. And the fact that I mix, mixed three colors to get her foundation, cause first I was using the black opal stick that I used on her for her birthday. And it looked, her skin looked just too dry. It didn't, it wasn't like a smooth. It wasn't like how I like it. I prefer liquid foundations. So I was like, okay, I'm about to try to mix these colors. So, so I started off with a light shade and I mixed it with another shade and I put it on her and it wasn't the shade. So then I mixed something darker and I kept mixing until I got the shade and I got it perfect. Like it matches her perfectly. That is crazy. Like, that just that was just the highlight of my day. It looks so good. She looks so pretty. I love her makeup. And I love her lid space. You see how big her eyes are? I did purple because her eyes are brown. Purple brings out brown. So that's why I did purple. Oh, she looks so pretty, bro. I found my other battery from you remember when I took sent my camera to Canon? And I was like, I know I didn't put the battery in there. <sighs> so now I got two batteries. Thank God. And I saw when this one about to die, I could just plop that one on in. But I'm about to try this place called Wings 101 for some fish. I was gonna go up to Q and take her this here. I actually got my ass on the freeway and then I realized I gotta go to Q house, but then Q not answering, so I just take her to here probably tomorrow. But I'm about to get, I want some fried fish, somebody get some fried fish. They got a combo with two pieces of fish, fries. So it looked pretty good. We gonna see though. And then we gotta get some seasoning. What kind of seasoning should I put on these fries? I want Cajun. Let's 
seasoning. Y'all, this is my fucking fish out cold. This is my fucking fish out cold, bro. It's fried hard. I ain't ate the hush puppy yet. Let's see. It's all right. Tastes a little fishy, but I feel. And these fries with a little ketchup with the Cajun with the seasoning salt. I'll call it with it. I'm finna watch. I think I'm finna watch the rest of This Is Us. I'm watching the SAG Awards. Why Angela so cute? She fine, girl. Look at that hair. She look good. And that dress shirt.